Do you remember the 2020 U.S. presidential election? It was one of the most dramatic and divisive elections in history. But it was only the first round. The second round is coming in 2024, and it's going to be even more intense. Trump and Biden are ready to face each other again, but they are not alone this time. There are many other candidates who might challenge them or join forces with them. But how did this happen? And what if Trump and Biden faced each other again in 2024? That's what this video is all about. Why Trump and Biden again? You might be wondering why Trump and Biden are likely to run again in 2024. After all, they are both in their late 70s and have faced a lot of criticism for their policies and actions. Well, there are several reasons why they might want to run again. I'll break it down into two main points. One, Biden is popular, but vulnerable. Let's start with Biden. He is currently the oldest president in U.S. history, having taken office at the age of 78. He has also been criticized for his frequent gaffes, such as forgetting names, dates, and facts. Some people have even questioned his mental fitness and cognitive abilities. Despite all these challenges, Biden has indicated that he intends to run for a second term in 2024. He has said that he is a transition candidate who will pass the torch to a younger generation of leaders. However, he has not named a successor or endorsed anyone from his party. He has also maintained a high approval rating among Democrats and independents, who see him as a moderate and pragmatic leader who can unite the country and restore its global reputation after the chaotic Trump era. Also, Biden has enjoyed high approval ratings for his handling of the COVID-19 pandemic, the economic recovery, and the withdrawal of troops from Afghanistan. He has also passed major legislation on infrastructure, health care, and climate change. However, some Democrats are worried that Biden might not run for a second term or might not be able to win against Trump. 2. Trump is divisive, but resilient. On the other hand, we have Trump. He is the first president in U.S. history to be charged twice, once for abuse of power and obstruction of Congress, and once for encouragement of rebellion. But Trump has remained the most influential figure in the Republican Party, despite being banned from social media platforms, facing multiple lawsuits and investigations, and losing support from some of his former allies. Despite all these troubles, Trump has not given up on his political ambitions. He has hinted that he will run again in 2024, saying that he is beyond serious, considering it. He has a loyal base of supporters among Republicans and conservatives who see him as a strong and charismatic leader who can defend their values and interests against the radical left. But some Republicans are afraid that Trump might run for president again or might not accept the outcome of the election. Now you might ask, what is the public's opinion of Trump and Biden? Trump and Biden's poll ratings. So how are Trump and Biden doing in the polls? Well, it depends on which polls you look at. Some polls show that Biden has a comfortable lead over Trump, while others show that they are neck and neck or that Trump has a slight edge. However, polls can be misleading or inaccurate, especially this far away from the election. A lot can change between now and then, such as new developments, scandals, events, or surprises. So don't take the polls too seriously at this point. However, one thing that is clear is that both Trump and Biden have strong bases of support among their respective parties. According to a recent poll by Politico Morning Consult, 85% of Democrats said they would vote for Biden if he ran again in 2024, while 76% of Republicans said they would vote for Trump if he ran again in 2024. That means that both candidates have loyal followers who will stick with them no matter what. However, Trump and Biden are not the only candidates who might run for president in 2024. Who are the other candidates? There are many other potential contenders who might challenge them or try to replace them as the nominees of their parties. Here are some of them. On the Republican side, some of the possible candidates include former Vice President Mike Pence, former UN Ambassador Nikki Haley, Florida Governor Ron DeSantis, Texas Senator Ted Cruz, and businessman Vivek Ramaswamy. On the Democratic side, some of the possible candidates include Vice President Kamala Harris, Massachusetts Senator Elizabeth Warren, Vermont Senator Bernie Sanders, and former South Bend Mayor Pete Buttigieg. 
These candidates have different backgrounds, experiences, views, and visions for America. They could offer more choices and diversity to the voters. Now that you know more about why the 2024 U.S. presidential election will likely be a choice between Biden and Trump again, you might be wondering, who should I vote for? Well, that's up to you. But before you make up your mind, let me ask you this. What kind of world do you want to live in? What kind of future do you want for yourself and your loved ones? Think about it. But wait, there's one more thing you need to know before you cast your vote. The possible scenarios. Another thing we need to ask is what does another Biden versus Trump election in 2024 mean for the future of America and the world? Well, there are several possible scenarios that could unfold depending on who wins. If Biden wins again, he will continue to undo Trump's policies and face the challenges of climate change, the economy, the racial justice movement, and China. He will also have to deal with the backlash from Trump's supporters who might not accept his legitimacy. If Trump wins again, he will resume to undo Biden's policies and face the same challenges as Biden. He will also have to deal with the consequences of his legal troubles, which might lead to his indictment or impeachment. In either case, America will remain divided and polarized along political, ideological, and cultural lines. The trust in democracy will be eroded and undermined by misinformation and propaganda. The role and influence of America in the world will be diminished and challenged by other powers and actors. Also, according to a recent poll, Biden leads Trump by 10 points in a hypothetical 2024 matchup. However, polls are not always reliable or accurate as there are many factors that could change the outcome of the race. Therefore, it is too early to predict who will win the 2024 election. The 2024 election will be a close and contentious race that will test the resilience and stability of American democracy, but the outcome is still uncertain and depends on many factors. It will also have significant implications for the future of America and the world, as both candidates have different agendas and challenges to face. So, what do you think? Are you ready for another round of Trump versus Biden? Or do you hope for a different outcome? Whatever your opinion, don't forget that you have the power to make a difference. Your voice matters. Your vote counts. Together, we can shape the future of our world. Thank you for watching, and we will see you soon.